Adam, what's your reaction to uh, Freddie retiring from Test cricket? Oh, wonderful news. <laughs> As an Australian, oh, that bloke terrorised me, particularly 2005. Um, frightening the way he bowled and performed in that series, particularly he's had to uh, bear a lot of the workload really from that time and his body's probably not reacted well to it, so he's realised that. But uh, in all seriousness, it's, it's a shame, it's a, a loss to the game in, in that regard. As we won't see him out on the test arena anymore. I'm sure we'll see him performing well in the limited overs versions of the game, but he's a, a wonderful cricketer and uh, more importantly, I found him, he's been a terrific bloke, a really good bloke to be around and just plays the game the way that you hope everyone tries to play. It just gets in there, gives it a crack and has a lot of fun doing it. Pretty gutted, to be honest. You know, like uh, he, he's been an iconic member for England for the last however many years, and uh, you know, I, I think everyone will remember him for the 2005 Ashes. You know, the, the way he played there and, and that sort of thing. And uh, it's going to be disappointing not to see him playing for England anymore. But uh, he's obviously got his own priorities, and uh, I'm sure he's going to be looking forward to playing these last four tests. I think there's definitely going to be a lot of sentiment around now about you know do it for Fred or help Fred produce the goods. Um, it's going to be great to watch. I, I think it'll, it'll be a little boost for the England team and, uh, and motivation for them will be escalated even higher. Oh, I, I don't think it'll, it'll mean too much at all. You know, like, uh, I think you know, whenever anyone retires, it's obviously sad for the game, but uh, cricket, the show must go on, as they say. But uh, I'm sure the England fans and uh, England team will be uh, looking to, to play well and, and put him out on a good note. I'd always be worried with Andrew Flintoff in the opposition. Um, I, I'm, I hope he plays every game. I think for the series, it'd be a real shame to, to see him sit out through injury. Uh, you know, and, and, and trying to speak as a, as a bit of a neutral, uh, as an observer of the game, I'm, I thought the result in Cardiff was amazing. I would love to have seen Australia be one nil up, but for the series, it's even better. Um, so things like that, and, and things like having a guy like Flintoff involved in the in the series, is only going to enhance the the product that that is uh, something that's extraordinary anyway. The Ashes. I'm sure that uh, he'll be looking to to play as well as what he can, as as we all know what he did in Cardiff, and uh, to continue to play well, starting in Lords on uh, Thursday. Mm -hmm.